Bullying in a Rock County school district could now earn students a ticket of up to $500. This comes after the district passed the new ordinance Monday night. Rock County reporter Adam Duxter joins us from our bureau at the Janesville Gazette with why district leaders say it's a fine they hope they will never have to give out. Adam? Yeah, Eric and Susan, the school district of Edgerton is actually just the third school district in our viewing area to adopt a policy like this one. And while some say giving a ticket to a school bully might be a little bit extreme, the district's hopeful that it'll bring bullying to light. We'll be requesting that the communication with your child. Edgerton Police Chief Robert Kowalski says this is the letter bullies and their parents. And no steps are taken to correct that behavior. Can soon expect to get. On Monday, Edgerton schools paired with police to pass a new anti-bullying ordinance. We're trying to be proactive. The ordinance says students punished for bullying could face a warning, then a fine, ranging between $10 and $500, depending on severity. What it is, a way to make a child aware uh, who might be picking on another child that it's not acceptable to do. District officials say to them, the decision was easy. To me, it, it makes so much sense to have that type of an ordinance. And while the district doesn't see bullying as an everyday concern. A repeat occurrence within 90 days. They say adopting a policy like this one sends the message they're trying to keep their students safe. For us, student safety is always our top priority, uh, whether that be physical safety or social emotional. And I think for us, success with this would be a reduction in the amount of incidents that we're addressing where bullying may be involved. In September, some prairie schools also adopted a policy like this one. And as to how effective it is, today I talked to a police lieutenant there on the phone who told me in three months they've issued just two warnings and only one citation. Adam Duxer in Rock County. Adam, thank you.